What's up Fish Huge fans? I'm Mr. Huge. Welcome to the Fish Huge YouTube channel where I show you how we fish huge. So today we're going to be doing a reel review on the Spin Fisher 6 5500 and the Quantum Cabo 50. Check it out. Alright guys, so here is the Spin Fisher 6 5500 5000 class. Um, it's well used. Um, you'll notice that it has some corrosion issues here. Um, the reel handle has cracked. Uh, that's probably mostly from um, hairline fractures and then corrosion getting into those hairline fractures. That will that will cause that. Um, uh, it has a really good drag system though. It has a big, uh, you know, for the size of halfway decent uh, drag here, so it's easy to use while you're reeling in fish. You can loosen or tighten your drag as you need to. If you notice that I, I do that a lot in my videos, I'll loosen and tighten my drag as I need. Um, this is the biggest thing that bothers me, and uh, the screws or the um, the springs in here and the mechanism in here fails on on these reels a lot uh, for some reason uh, you know they didn't go with stainless or, or good quality spring in there so those fail a lot uh, that causes uh, the line to go on crooked and it doesn't allow for the the uh, bail to seat right you see how it's kind of in an odd position there it makes makes the line go on uneven uh, you get 39 inches of retrieve um, the gear ratio is uh, 5.6 to 1 so you know the gear ratio is pretty good in these uh, for as far as cranking power goes it's 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 really good a strong reel uh, for cranking power you can get those big grouper up you can get the snapper up um, line capacity is really good uh, those those kingfish can take long runs those tuna can take long runs and like I said the, the drag system on them is really good so you can stop those bigger fish for 5500 it's good I'm just disappointed in the corrosion and um, and, and, and the uh, handle splitting here and the uh, and the spring in there failing all the time so that that's probably my biggest disappointment in, in in these reels so but as far as price point goes um they are not one of the more expensive reels you can get them for around 200 or under <clears throat> so for what you get it's a good reel if you're a weekend warrior um it, it, you know it, these corrosion issues happen because i'm on the water almost every single day and um and, and for me, I got to go to a little more expensive setup and I got to find uh, the right thing for somebody that goes fishing all the time. This probably isn't the reel for you. You're going to want something a little more durable, um, which is why for the for this, um, I would suggest in the in the 50 class, the 5000 class, um, I would go to the Quantum. Uh, uh, Cabo 50 and this thing has a really good drag system the only thing I don't like about the drag is the 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 top up here is a little small so sometimes I'm, I'm missing the drag trying to uh, loosen or tighten the drag I wish they would have made that a lot bigger so you can just get in there and loosen and tighten it as you need to um, you, you know but as far as it goes this uh, is a really uh, durable setup it's really lightweight and you see they got you know real big screws holding it together a nice durable handle uh, so far uh, I've been using this uh, about a year now and uh, so far it's held together nice it uh, still reels real good um, I haven't had any issues with it and and again it has uh you know 20 pounds of drag it holds uh, plenty of line so so for the drag you can uh you can stop those fish when they're making those long runs 
and uh, it's got plenty of line for those long runs and also when uh, you, you're grouper digging or, or you're trying to get those uh, those big mangrove snappers uh, it has the stopping power to uh, get those fish up and, and keep them from getting to the rocks and you know nice strong handle has a 5.3 to 1 gear ratio so you get about 36 inches worth of retrieval with this reel I do wish the handle was a little a little bigger so that you can grab it easier um, you, you know if that was a little bit bigger handle I think you'd get a better grip on it and make it a little easier on somebody but uh, you know as far as that goes um, you know you don't really need tons of turning power on, on the on the reel so uh, you, you just really need to know how to work those fish um, and and this is a really excellent reel it's been really good to me for uh, this last year so uh, I, I think this would be the one to get the price point is a little bit uh, higher at closer to 200 to 250 um, uh, but it does have the titanium uh, thing there you can twist it all up and do stuff to it it's fine uh, so for for durability it doesn't corrode there this spring still acts really good like I said it still reels good um, and it uh, looks like they put a little extra into uh, making it a more durable reel so there you go guys that's my reel review I'm Mr. Huge please hit the subscribe button if this video helps you out share with your friends Check out this video coming up. It's the perfect rod and reel combination to catch these huge mangrove snappers. Thank you for joining me. Fish huge.